boys and girls, welcome to Circle Time with Mrs. T. How are you doing today? You're doing good? I am so glad to hear that. We have some fun stories, but we're going to start with a song. So we're going to open and shut our hands. Can you open them and shut them? Here we go. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Fold them in your lap, lap, lap. Great job. Our first story today is called, I Ain't Gonna Paint No More. One day, my mama caught me painting pictures on the floor and the ceiling and the walls and the curtains and the door. And I heard my mama holler like I never did before. You ain't gonna paint no more. I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. That's what I say, but there ain't no way that I ain't gonna paint no more. So I take some red and I paint my head. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Oh, what the heck? I'm gonna paint my neck. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Still, I just can't rest till I paint my chest. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Guess there ain't no harm if I paint my arm. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. But I just can't stand not to paint my hand. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Then I see some black, so I paint my back. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Like an Easter egg, I'm gonna paint my leg. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. Still I ain't, co ain't complete till I paint my feet. Now I ain't gonna paint no more. I ain't gonna paint no more, no more. I ain't gonna paint no more. But I'm such a nut. I'm gonna paint my what? You all don't faint, cause there ain't no paint. So I ain't gonna paint no more. I hope you enjoyed our first story, boys and girls. We have a fun science experiment for you. So we're gonna try and make a rainbow. Now I have some milk. Our milk is right here and I already poured it on our plate. And we have some Q-tips, some soap, and then we have food coloring. Now remember, if you wanna do this, make sure you ask your mommies or your daddies or your grandmas and grandpas for some help. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our food coloring and we're just gonna put some dots around and this is yellow food coloring. Doesn't look very yellow when it touches the milk, but you'll see what will happen. Here's some green. So I'm gonna put some green on and then I'm gonna put some blue on. Now we're going to try some red. Here we go. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my Q-tip and I'm gonna dip it in just some regular dish soap and let's see what happens. Are you ready? Whoa, look at that. Whoa, and if I go around, it'll make even more of a rainbow. Now you can see the yellow, the blue, how cool is that? Let's try it one more time. Wow. I hope you enjoyed that, boys and girls. Our next story is called, What Makes a Rainbow? Little Rabbit and his mother were sitting under a big red flower petal. Look, said Little Rabbit, the rain is stopping. Yes, said Mama Rabbit, soon we'll see a rainbow. What makes a rainbow, asked Little Rabbit. Why don't you ask your friends, said Mama Rabbit. Ladybug, what makes a rainbow, asked Little Rabbit. Red, said Ladybug, gently closing her red wings. You need red 
to make a rainbow. Mr. Fox, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Orange, said Mr. Fox, swishing his orange tail. You need orange to make a rainbow. Little Chick, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Yellow, said Little Chick, fluffing her yellow fuzz. You need yellow to make a rainbow. Mr. Grasshopper, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Green, said Mr. Grasshopper, rubbing his green legs together. You need green to make a rainbow. Bluebird, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Blue, said Bluebird, ruffling her pretty blue feathers. You need blue to make a rainbow. Butterfly, what makes a rainbow? asked Little Rabbit. Violet, said Butterfly, spreading her delicate violet wings. You need violet to make a rainbow. Well, said Mama Rabbit to Little Rabbit, now you know what makes a rainbow. Rain, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet, and sunshine. How'd you like our stories, my friends? I had a great time reading to you today. That's all we have time for, so we're gonna sing our goodbye song together. Here we go. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye for now, my friends. So long, farewell, until we meet again. Bye-bye for now. Don't forget to click the subscribe button.